guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. Today we're going to take a look at EZA Tech Vegito Blue. Uh, definitely one of the more highly anticipated EZA characters. Um, let's see how good they made him. Um, we'll go ahead and start out by giving our boy a sticker. Um, as a Dokkan Festival exclusive, Tech Vegito Blue, he's had a sticker since they introduced the format a couple years ago. And his looks good. Um... There's a couple of things about stickers that tend to make them look good. One is uh, key blast super attacks like that uh, usually do look very good. And then the Super Saiyan Blue Aura on a lot of these characters looks very good with stickers. So, all right, let's um check this guy out. Rainbow, Link Level 10, Tech Vegito Blue, Easy A. Let's see how good he is. All right, guys, so here we are. Uh, this is our first turn with uh, our boy Tech VB. Um, let's take a look at what we got right here. So, he's at 144k defense. So, okay. Um, he's looking a lot better than Namek Goku uh, right here at the start, right? So, uh, I, okay. I, Tech VB has a similar, like, I feel like what he's doing and stuff like that is similar to Namek Goku. But he might actually be a bit better. Um, I think... Namek Goku is probably not really the character we want to compare Tech VB to anyway, though. Because um, Tech VB, as an easy ATUR, I would like to compare him to other easy ATURs, right? So, uh, the AGL Evolution Blue Vegeta, Future Gohan, SR Ultimate Gohan, Turles. Those are the characters I'd like to compare him to. But this is like a similar-ish level of defense you'll see from Namek Goku. Namek Goku, I, I, think, I think a lot of times like 180k, right? But the thing is, is that Vegito Blue... He's getting 50% defense when he attacks. And it is, um, uh, like, a, a separate phase. So, it's uh, multiplicative right here, right? So, Vegito is going to be getting... Like, his defense is, is a lot better than what we're looking, right? One super attack. And, I mean, he's way over 200k, right? Like, is he getting 70k defense, like, when he actually attacks? Like, because 50%. So, he, he should be looking okay. Uh, remember that Vegito Blue does stack as well um, on his 12 key supers. Now, for sure, like Namek Goku, uh, we would have frustrating concerns in the, the toughest content early on. I would like to see how fast this guy stacks up, though, right? Because he does stack attack and defense on his super attack effect. It is... I believe it's a 20% buff um, uh, uh, when he stacks on his super attack, right? Um, he... Doesn't build up defense from his passive, but he does build up attack from his passive, right? The other thing that he does, too, is his additionals are now guaranteed with a 30% chance to be a super attack. Um, so it's like, you know, we could get turns of four supers. Um, and unlike Namek Goku, again, I don't really want to compare him too much to Namek Goku, but, I mean, I, I just see a lot of similarities in how these guys are going to be used and, and how they're built and stuff like that, right? Um, so forgive me on that one, but Namek Goku does not additional super as much as people think he does, um, because you can't run him in slot one in tough content, N no, dude. Um, and maybe once you get to, like, Tech Bojack, you know, strongest tech enemy in the game, you could get Namek Goku in slot one against him for sure, and get the guaranteed additional super from that way, but, you know, you have to be going up type advantage for Namek Goku to be in slot one, basically. Now, Tech VB, he's gonna be, he has two guaranteed additionals. Whereas Namek Goku does does not... Well, he has one guaranteed additional, right? No, no, actually... Wait, no, no, Namek Goku, it, it's a, it's only a chance. Yeah, Namek... Wait, wait I, I actually have to double-check Namek Goku. But I, I believe it's it's only a chance. Because you're most of the times you're going to be running Namek Goku in slot 2 or 3, right? Yeah, because Namek Goku is just, Like, it's not the way you want it worded. The way you want this worded is how Tech VB has it, right? Where it's... Uh, additional, which has a medium chance of being a super. Namek Goku is, is medium chance of launching an additional super. So, Vegito is going to be putting up so many more super attacks and additionals than Namek Goku. Namek Goku getting one super or one super in a normal is very common. VB getting two supers per turn is going to be relatively realistic, I'd say. Um, <clears throat> let's All right, so let's see what we got right here. So, opening rotation... We have, uh, his, so his link set is Super Saiyan, Warrior Gods, Kamehameha, um, Power Bestowed by God, Fuse Fighter, Over in a Flash, and Fierce Battle. Not a great link set, I would say. I'm going to keep him in the in the um, middle slot right here, because we will activate uh, Super Saiyan. 
Vegito does have an ability, um, which I, I, I don't really recommend people go for, um, where he gets three key and a medium chance to crit in the same turn after he gets hit. But I don't... That could be good to get you the additional key, right? But I don't know that this guy is ever going to be going in slot one uh, unless... Like, me, me, dude, even AGL Broly. I don't know. Okay, so 1.78 right there is pathetic. So, I mean, if we're talking about Namek Goku, in that exact, like, situation, Namek Goku's tossing up a 7 million attack stat super, right? Like, we do want to keep that in mind. Now, Vegito is building up, um, def or he's building up attack from his passive. So, we got four attacks right there, right? So... Uh, Vegito builds up 20% attack with each attack performed up to a max of 200%. So we built up 80% attack already just from that first turn. So that is pretty good. Um, I don't know. I, I feel like there's, this Vegito can definitely be good, but it, it, it's, again, I, I really hate that Namek Goku is the comparison, but like that's, he, they, they're so similar in what they're doing. I, I feel like, you know... Vegito's strengths and flaws are just very similar to like what Namek Goku is able to do, right? Like if you if you could vision the level that Namek Goku can be at, Vegito will be there. Better defense than Namek Goku, but worse offense. I, I think is the way that this Vegito will pan out. Let me see what a start of turn defense is going to look like on this next turn. So again, keep in mind that you know the the defense we see at the start of turn, Vegito is still getting fifty percent when attacking. It is multiplicative too. Uh, you know, oftentimes there's so much controversy about these units before they even release, right? Like, he just came out. The thing with it was in the data download at first, it was, like, not um, functioning correctly. But they did another data download and fixed it, right? So, okay. So now this Vegito Blue will transform. The one thing, though, I think that's going to be a serious issue for Tech VB. Not this one. This guy's fodder at this point. But uh, the TUR Force, the thing that's going to be an issue for him is his link set um this link set is not going to be great um on a lot of these builds we're, we're gonna want to run so vegeto is on several teams that have good uh setups right now realm of gods has the resurrection f blue t like you know blue is going on vegeto is not on there 200 though because he's not a pure saiyan um vegeto is on future saga which is the team we're running right here um, and we are getting the 200% leader skill from, uh, Battle of Fate, which the, um, Vegeta and Trunks have, right? Uh, and then Vegito is also on, uh, both of the 200% leader skills of the 7th Anniversary LRs. Because Vegito is on Power Beyond Super Saiyan, and he's on Fuse Fighters. So Vegito does have three separate 200% leader skills that we can rock with here, for sure, right? So... One stack, and he's at 187k. In that first turn, we only got one super attack. It's like we're going to need more super attacks before this defense is looking good, right? Um, so we got hit first, so that gives us the key, and then we have the medium chance to go. What is this attack? Oh my goodness, this attack skyrocketed. Okay. Um, okay, the beginning of this run has not been great, um, so far for what we want to see from VB. I mean, we're going to be on turn six with two super attacks. Uh, this is the other thing, too, with, you know, Namek Goku VB type characters is, depending upon the way the fight could go, we very easily could have quad supered with VB turn one, right? Easily. Um, but there's, th I would say, like, what's going on here, in my experience, is more often, more common, right? Where it's like, oh, we're not looking that great. The other thing that happens is we're on the off rotation. We keep getting to this, like, Vegeta um, with, like, you know, one health bar left, right? Which is very unfortunate um, for Vegito, you know, trying to get a whole bunch of super attacks. Hopefully this Vegeta and Trunks, if they could, like, triple super right here and uh, finish this Vegeta off, that would be fantastic, man. Uh, okay, give me one more at least. No? Ah, that sucks, yeah. This, this, this is brutal so far. This is not going good at all. We could get his. I, I kind of want to do that active skill. It's so uncommon, I get that. So we're up to 234. That's only with two supers. And, I mean, he's getting... He gets 50% when he attacks. 
I, I can see Vegito being very effective in a lot of red zone stages, but, you, you know, it's like Namek Goku. You need luck. You know, you, you can get it to work sometimes, but it, it, it's, it's you're, you're going to need things to, like, perfectly go your way. Because um, it's like, you know, we, we could, you know, oh, Vegito could get to 900k defense so easily. But it's like, his damage is looking good. I mean, if we if he pops out three or four of those on a turn, right? Like, he, he could be doing insane amounts of damage, man. It could be looking pretty good. All right, I would like to, like, not... Oh, God, this... Sometimes uh, showcasing is held. <laughs> oh, my God. Every turn, like, it's like we're, we, we're always going to get it to where this Vegeta's got a sliver. Because um, I'd, I'd like VB to get one of these, like, quad super turns. I will probably hop, like, so I think we'll probably, you know, run through this event. We'll, we'll do a full run here. Um, and then I might hop back in um, and then just try and just get VB stacking up a lot. I guess I could go into, like, the Rosé Dokkan event or something like that um, against one of these invincible bosses. And we can uh, just sort of stack up uh, in that fashion, right? And sort of see how things are going to go. Um, all right. Oh, that's going to do a lot of damage right there. Yeah, STR Goku Black. He's, um... <laughs> Ow. Owie. Thank you, Goku Black. <laughs> all right, man. Okay. <clears throat> well, the good news, right, is that we've got a good-looking turn here. Hopefully, Vegeta doesn't super right away. So... We're at 230k defense again. He's getting 50%. I mean, we're getting pretty deep in here without as much um, defense as I would like, though. I could do the Father Son Gallop Gun, which would give us extra defense, but um, I want VB to get as many attacks in. VB is not fully built up either, right? We have not even come close to the. Because he has to do 10 attacks to be fully built up. We have not done 10 attacks. Okay, there's a normal. We're not getting any luck with... Okay, there we go. There's a second additional right there. Beautiful. All right, you know, getting the stack, stacking the attack, stacking the defense. Uh, VB, yeah, it, 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 it is interesting. He, he's very... I feel like he's very similar to Namek Goku. Um, hmm. Uh, that, to me, is good, though. Like, if I'm actually saying, like, yeah, like, VB is... He's, he's very similar to Namek Goku... Namek Goku, I feel like I definitely would have said, is on a level above all of these easy ATUR characters, right? So, if, if VB, if I'm seeing comparisons to him, I, I, I do think VB could be the number one TUR, right? It's just, it's one of these things where you're just going to have so many turns where he's either just not... Like, I, I can envision... I don't know, I wouldn't run this guy against Bojack anyway, but I can envision... Gokua and Beto and Bujin and shit like that bullying this Vegito Blue the way they could Namek Goku, right? That same weakness would be there. Um, I don't know if I'd run Tech VB against Omega either. Because um, there's just too much... Like, there'd be too many turns of type disadvantage we'd have to deal with against Omega that would just be not... I, I, I just would not want to put up with, right? Um, okay, I'm actually gonna use an item here, uh, cause I, 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 gonna, I just, just want to get this showcase in without this damn Goku Black. So we're at 311k now. And he gets, he's still getting the 50%. Uh, he, he is good. Um, he's definitely better than Evolution Blue Vegeta. I, I I'm definitely putting him above Turles. I don't know if I'm putting him above Future Gohan, though. I have not seen we uh, we have not used Rose in action, right? So we're not I'm really not counting Rose yet. I uh, I can see myself settling this guy in as the number 2 easy ATUR. Like if if I had to do it right now, I'd probably say Future Gohan 1 VB2 and then probably the Blue Vegeta S3. I think probably is what I would do. Um although this is running him with his best linking partner. And this Vegito Blue is not runnable in difficult content at like at all. He's not. He's completely ass, right? So, I mean, if we look at Vegito's link set, right? Super Saiyan. I mean, he has two key links: Fuse Fighter and Over in a Flash. That's a, that's an issue. Um, neither of these are are links like. Let's look at these characters, man. Um, I, like, Gogeta, I guess. 
this Gogeta, this Gotenks is good. I, I mean, if, if we're going to run that Gotenks against, like, Android 13 or maybe trying to do it against, like, Broly. Although, I don't know that I, that Gotenks, would I run him against Broly? You could, but, hmm. And then over in a flash, I just... I guess we could run Kaioken Goku. The only thing is that Vegito Blue and Kaioken Goku, like, these are not... You don't have a slot one character there. Majin Vegeta? Run, like, Majin Vegeta slot one and then VB slot two? I guess that could work. I don't know. L links are going to be an issue for Vegito Blue currently. If we had over in a flash characters that were relevant, sure. I, I mean, UI Goku is definitely aged. God Goku's aged. You do have God this God Goku, though. So, like, if we're going to fight Broly, that would certainly work. Okay, okay. UI Goku. I don't know. We'll, 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 keep, we'll, we'll keep trying. I... I like this Vegito, but L let's see what damage numbers we're going to hit here. Our damage is going to start to get really, really high soon. Oh, like right now, he's at 8.5. <laughs> okay. Yeah, his, his attack stat is at 8.5 right here. I think, did we fully build up his pass? I have not been keeping track of his actual attacks. Remember, he has to do 10 attacks to fully build up. Now, okay, so an 8 into a 9. Um... Wow, okay. Um, what if I said this guy has a higher ceiling than Namek Goku? I, I feel like he does. Am I crazy? I, di I did not intend this to turn into a Namek Goku <laughs> bashing video. But, like, does that mean I think physical future Gohan is better than Namek Goku? Hmm. I don't know. I, I'm I wanna reserve judgment until I see Vegito Blue in action. I'm gonna take him again. I don't like the idea of using him against Omega, but that's like the gauge. Right I mean Omega's the strongest int boss in the game. I mean if we could go in there and Vegito Blue can handle himself well, I, that's gonna look very good for him, but I mean you know, we could start the fight out, Omega locks us at as GG. It, it, if Ome Ome a lot of times I've fought Omega, he seems to know, and he seals Tech Ultimate Gohan so often, right? It just feels like Tech Ultimate Gohan, I can never super attack against Omega because he keeps him seal locked. So, like, if, if we encounter um, something along those lines, that would be very bad. Okay. Four we're up to 400k, right? Namek Goku, I feel like he definitely, he builds his defense up faster, but I feel like there's more RNG involved in it too, right? Because um, Vegito Blue, it's much easier for him to get additional supers compared to Namek Goku. Because um, Vegito, again, has got the guaranteed additionals and stuff like that. Um, but Namek Goku, I feel like is getting much bigger actual like defensive buffs uh, from those super attacks he's doing. All right, um... I kind of just want to build, like... Okay. <laughs> we... Three dodged. <laughs> okay. Sure, man. You guys like that three dodge right there? Please super again. No? Damn. Three additionals. Going a lot of crit for this guy could be a really good idea. I... Yeah, I, I, I probably should have prioritized more crit for him. Because you're just going to have a parade of normal attacks you're going to be doing, right? Um, with this Vegito right here. So, like, if, if those are all crits, he could be doing very good damage. Um, I don't think, like, caring about his medium chance to crit in his passive either is relevant. Like, that don't... That, yeah, that is going to be such an uncommon thing. Like, you, you never really want to go for that. Because it's like, even against, like... AGL Broly, right? Like, on this turn right here, like, I feel like AGL Broly's doing 300k plus on a super attack before Vegito attacks still, I think. Um, let's push off B. I should have pushed off B Pan a turn earlier. We get the, the really nasty uh, active skill buff here. Uh, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, so on this next turn, we're gonna have no support. I feel like 
Again, what I'm probably going to settle on is future Gohan as the number one easy ATUR and then VB as two. I'm looking at VB and he definitely doesn't look like a fumble to me, right? Like, Int Angel Golden Frieza is a damn fumble. Uh, I'm not I'm not seeing that from this guy. Like, he's going to have his uses. It's just, you know, it, it, it's going to... If you think of him similar to Namek Goku, I feel like that's the correct way to assess this character is actually like that. I, Again, I usually don't like, though, um, to compare units, like, at, like out of that, right? Because, like, I want to compare VB to, like, Physical Future Gohan and Turles and SCR Ultimate Gohan. But, like, what he's doing is just so reminiscent of Namek Goku. I think I'm going to pop this. Oh, okay, what is our defense here? 375k. Okay, what about, like, that? 357. So, with this unit, we'd only have Super Saiyan and Fierce Battle. But look, look at the key issues, right? Huge problem. I'm going to pop um, the Father-Son Gallic Gun right here. Um, I, I would like to see what our uh, additional defense is after we pop this. Alright, <clears throat> let's see how our defensive, uh, or our defense has jumped up, up to 450. Dude, that father-son Gallic gun, that is strong, man. Wow, okay. <clears throat> not bad. Okay, let's see what Vegito does in this turn. Um, I, again, I have not been, like, counting Vegito's attacks, but 1,000,000,000 billion percent right here. Um, we do have Vegito's full attack built up. Okay, okay. Nice nothing damage, Vegeta. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Okay. Please give me additional supers. You, you want to look good for your showcase, Vegito. God damn it. There we go. And then he ends with a 7 million right there. Vegito is is looking very strong to me. Um, He is good. He is. He is. Um, I, I, I feel like... Now, stop me if you've heard this before, but... It, his defense, it will become good in a lot of instances, but I I really do wish he had more. Um, I wish they would build these characters um, a little bit better able to take hits from tough red zone bosses. Um, because we are now six months in for red zone, right? It, it, it's okay if they drop... Easy A Tech Vegito Blue, and he's able to cook Red Zone Broly, right? Like, that's not... I, I don't think it's a problem when the, the event is now six months old, right? Um, but we'll see, we'll see. All right, um... Hmm. I, I'm trying to think... I think I want to... I'm just going to run just sort of like a basic... Maybe LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta team and just do a run real fast. Uh, l let me just try and build, like, a, a team... Wh hold on. Alright guys, we're doing a run on the LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta team. Now remember, Vegito is getting the 200% right here, right? Because he's on Fuse Fighter and Kamehameha, so we're getting the 200%. This is like, I mean, besides like the the Go Tanks, I probably would not run him. These are a lot of like red zone level characters, right? This is like a very red zone like esque rotation we could get right here, right? Because like, let's say we're fighting Broly. I probably would run Tech Gogeta on the team. I probably would, you know, run the LR Gods and then VB like this. And th this this is his issue, right? Is that as the game is constructed right now, VB is not linking well with all the other top units on his teams. This is his problem, right? Um, it, there aren't, like, really top-tier characters with Fuse Fighter and Over and a Flash all over all these teams right now. Now, I would say it, it could be very easy for that to change, right? You know, and, you know, we, we definitely, if we could run him with, like, Tech God Goku, that would certainly help him out a lot. You know, God Goku's a character who could be floating around on 
a, a couple of these different 200% teams. He's not on the LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta team, but he is on the Gods team. He is on Vegeta and Trunks' team, right? Um, but I, I do think with a lot of the top characters right now, um, the fact that Vegito Blue does not link well with them is certainly an issue. Um, and if we talk about, like, Physical Future Gohan, AGL, VB, they link great with all the characters you're running them with. And then even if, if we continue the comparison to Namek Goku, Namek Goku has an amazing link set, right? Very consistent. All, like, all the top units you want to run with Namek Goku, he's linking up beautiful with them, right? This is, this is Vegito Blue's weakness currently, is this right here. Uh, this would be the issue for us. Um, okay, so let, let's let's see how we're looking. So this is turn one. Now, we, we got to be careful. We're going up against one of the gods of the game, Raditz. This is the 200% leader scale Raditz Dokkan event. So I don't know if uh, Vegito Blue's quite on this level. Yeah, his damage starts off so bad. Because um, it's like Namek Goku turn one can be doing... He could do three seven millions, right, with his 12 key. Um, and then we jump up to three million towards the end. But, I mean, remember, you know, Vegito, he gets 150% defense start a turn. The other 50% is on attack. It is multiplicative, again. He has his two guaranteed additionals, which have a 30% chance of being a super. He doesn't get any start of turn attack. It's all build up, right? 20% attack with each attack performed up to a max of 200%. So, we do want to keep that in mind, right? That he, he is completely building up. Um... I don't know. I, I, I feel content um, using VB already. Like, I, I feel good about this. I mean, maybe I could do one more run. We could we could let him build up for a while. But, like, we, we saw VB build up. Like, we saw the damage numbers he will hit. Um, we saw the defensive numbers that the guy can hit as well, too, right? Um, so, let's see. So, we got, what, two supers last turn? Um, and we are at 192k. Remember, he's getting the 50% uh, when he attacks. His defense is just so low. Start a turn. It's just you gotta you gotta get so lucky at the start with him defensively, right? Like you know the, the proper way to use a lot of characters in red zone, unless we're talking about like the gods, right? You know or LR Super Saiyan Four Goji. They're just so good. You run them in every stage anyway. A lot of these red zone fights, you really do want to be gearing your team towards the final phase. So it's like, when I'm thinking of this Vegito Blue, I'm thinking of him fighting Android 13. I'm thinking of him fighting uh, Broly. And I guess the Shadow Dragons as well. The longest red zone fight this guy would cook. Because, you know, we, we would have plenty of time to stack up the entire way through, right? Um, but this is a character who could get cocked hard by Key, I think, in a lot of these stages. A lot of these runs, right? Um, he does link up fairly well with the gods. Super Saiyan, Warrior Gods, Kamehameha, Fierce Battle, but he doesn't have key links with them, right? And the gods are just so much better. We want to funnel as much key towards them as we could. So, I don't know. Let me know what you guys are thinking about this uh, Tech Vegito Blue here. Um, he is definitely good. He's definitely strong. I'm not looking at this guy. Like, Angel Gold and Freeze, I was like, dude, what, what are they thinking? Like, they weren't even using their brains when they made him. Th this is not the same thing, right? But, I mean, it's very easy with these characters. You give them stacking, and you're at least giving them some value, right? Because it's like things could go their way. You know, you don't get attacked the whole run or something like that, right? Like, it, it could go well. Um, and that's that's sort of what's going on here, right? Like, you know, with this VB, it's like you, if, if you get hit early, yeah, you're dead. But, like, if he doesn't get hit early, then he could be very tanky, you know, by the time you'd get to AGL Broly or something like that. So, all right. Um, okay, Vegito, okay. All right, guys. Um, so I'm gonna do one more build-up run. I just want to see what VB can get up to. So this is him turn one. Uh, I mean, this is similar to like Namek Goku's starting defensive level that I've seen in a lot of like actual runs. Um, but I mean, this is with Kid Gohan's 59% defensive support, right? Um, I think this guy really is very similar to Namek Goku, right? Like, if if you're using this character in that same level. Um, that's, like, like, just think of him as, like, another version of Namek Goku. Uh, this guy has better defense turn one, I feel like, most of the time. I mean, I don't know, you might need two super attacks to really hit it, right? But, you know, he, he is gonna be... I, I, yeah, I, I think he, he is gonna have better defense than Namek Goku, I think, 99% of the time, turn one. Um, but Namek Goku's damage... I mean, 
Vegito is doing these 1 in 2 million attack stats turn 1. Nimic Goku is doing 7 million with, like, exactly 12 key and no support, right? So, it's a big difference there. But you're definitely going to be seeing Vegito um, do more super attacks than you are for Nimic Goku, right? So, all right, I'm going to come back um, in a million, billion, zillion turns. And uh, we'll see how uh, our boy Vegito is looking once we've stacked up uh, quite a bit here. All right, guys, we're here on turn seven, and we have VB at 355,000. So he's going to be over 500k defense here, which, I mean, it's just, I don't see you, like, going type neutral, right, against a lot of these red zone bosses, it's, it's, it's just going to be a little bit scary. Definitely going into, like, a type, like, type advantage, I, I think. As much as you possibly can is going to help out quite a bit in there. Let's see the attack numbers from Vegito, um, and we'll, we'll we'll come back in a, a few turns as well, um, and sort of see what uh, Vegito's attack and defense of numbers are looking like. He does build up. He is going to have use, right? Um, if they drop a legendary event, he could certainly be fine there. Um, we will see. We will see. Okay, 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 VB. There's there's another super attack, right? A lot of it is just RNG, man. Like, you know, if, like, turn one and turn two, like, you're quad and triple super in, like, sure, but... All right, guys, here we are on turn 13. VB at 461k defense. Let's go and pop B-Pan's active skill. Let's see what damage we can get from our boy VB, and then we'll finish up. So, let me know what you guys think of him. I think I'm gonna sort of walk away from this character, um, having him as one of the top easy ATURs. He's definitely a good unit, right? Um, I, I mean, I don't, he's not approaching on like top 10 in the game unit level or anything like that, but I, I do think you could get this guy to help you in, in several stages across the game. So he is looking good. Um, they definitely did give him a strong easy A, uh, but I mean, he's going to be, I'll tell you all this, Vegito Blue will be better in other people's hands than mine because I have horrible luck when it comes to additional supers and stuff like that. Right. So my tech VB will be supering once per turn. Um, and y'all can super three and four times per turn. Like, that's the thing about Namek Goku, dude. I, like, I look at the comment section and people are like, well, actually, when he triple supers every turn, he's so good. It's like, uh, mine doesn't triple super every turn. It must be nice, dude. This sounds good. I wish I could do that. All right, so this is Strength Beyond Gods. Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegito, or, you know, Blue Vegito. Uh, his leader skill is super type allies, uh, four key and 140%. Um, if the team has all five super types, it's a pointless leader skill. I feel like you're not going to get use out of that. Um, his super attack is the final Kamehameha, which stacks attack and defense, disables enemy guard, and does immense damage to the enemy. So, that means he's not going to get slowed down by int type units with the, the, the disable enemy guard right there. His passive skill, Absolute Onslaught, gives him 150% defense at the start of turn. He gets another 50% when attacking. It is multiplicative, uh, so it, it's a different phase, right? So that's good. Um, then he gets two additional attacks, each of which has a medium chance of being a super attack. Remember, with his EZA, they did make the second additional guaranteed. It used to not be, right? Previously, Vegito's first additional was guaranteed. Second additional is a 70% chance. Now both are guaranteed, which does help. Um, making the second one guaranteed means seeing this guy do four hits is going to be common. It's just, will you get lucky? And these will be, you know, two or three supers, or is he going to do a bunch of normal attacks, right? Um, then Vegito gets 20% attack with each attack performed, up to a max of 200%. And then finally, he gets three key and a medium chance to crit, um, after he gets hit, um, it could be good, right, in certain AoE attacking boss fights. Um, Vegito's links are Super Saiyan, Kamehameha, Warrior Gods, Power Bestowed by God, Fuse Fighter, Over in a Flash, and Fierce Battle. Um, 12 key multiplier is 160%. Very uncommon. You only have a handful of characters in the game that have a 160% 12 key multiplier. Again, very, very uncommon. Um, in terms of easy A's this guy would help out in, there's really none. 
actually. Like, there's there's no, like, characters here. Um, there's no, like, AGL EZAs that this guy would cook. Interesting. Yeah, okay, okay. Um, and then finally, Vegito is on a lot of category teams. And he's on category teams that do need buffs, too. So he's on Realm of Gods. You know, extra units for Realm of Gods is good. Um, he's on Patara. Patara is a team that needs help for sure. Uh, he's also over here on the Future Saga category team. Another team I do not mind getting help. Uh, he's also over here on Time Traveler. I am going to be very interested to see what the Time Traveler team is going to look like once that gets a proper lead. Uh, Vegito is also over here on the Kamehameha category team also. Um, then Vegito is also over here on the Final Trump card team. Another team that I'm really excited for it to get a top tier uh, leader, for sure. Uh, Vegito, this is Battle of Wits right here. Battle of Wits is actually uh, going to be, I think, another intriguing 200% um, at some point in the future. Uh, then he's also over here on Time Limit. This is the Time Limit category team. Uh, then he is also on... This is Accelerated Battle. Yeah, this is the Accelerated Battle category. Uh, then right here, this is the Battle of Fate category. Remember, he has a 200% from LR, Vegeta, and Trunks right here from this Battle of Fate 200%. Uh, then he's also over here on the 7th Anniversary Fused Fighter team right here, which is very, very good. Um, and then finally, uh, he is here on the Power Beyond Super Saiyan category team. So let me know what you guys think of EZA Tech Vegito Blue. Um, I, I feel like I'm going to walk out of this with him. Man, I don't know. He, one or two for easy ATURs. It's just, f future Gohan is just like, uh, like that's exactly like the type of character that you really need. I would probably lean towards future Gohan as the best easy ATUR after Vegeta and Trunks were introduced into the game. I think Future Gohan and Int Majin Vegeta just got so much stronger. They're just so much stronger now, right? Like, it, it, we have to reassess, what, like, their value level. Um, but this guy looks good. Um, again, I, I think comparable to Namek Goku, which, I, that is a good thing for this guy. Because this is not a Dokkan Fest LR. This is, a, a, this is a, a unit who came out in 2017 who is now good again, right? So, I think they actually did do a pretty good job with this guy's EZA. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch you guys next time.